Hey, ma'am. I, I work Anthony here at the university. Nice university. university. Let me just give you the lowdown on what you're allowed to do when it comes to solicitation on a college campus. Okay, so it's a public space, right. but within our confines, we, we are allowed to, to, to choose what can be here. And we do that through a process of applying to be able to be in public space. So do you have your form that, that you were able to be on Coleman Common? No. Okay, all right, so there is a system which you certainly can do all of this, absolutely. But you have to go through the university policy for which it just says, I'd like to use outdoor space. They make sure they ask you what you do, how you're gonna do it, check, 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 and you have your permission. And so, and then that's how you get to do this. Is there a reason why there is sort of like a permission? Yes, there is. So, they, so anybody from, uh, from anybody that a student organization wants to be out in the, in the, on the common ground because it's, it's known as a reservation. So this is a space and, and, the, and the meeting room and, and the building is the same thing. It's a, it's a space. And so they just make sure they know who's in every space. That's just how it works. They're not going to deny you, sir. I guarantee you. You want to do this, okay. you just have to have your space reservation. And so... And what is the process like for doing that? Are you an outside group or are you affiliated with a student organization? Stand and Young Americans, you good at your door? We're Young Americans for Liberty. Uh, okay. We are awesome. So ready it, this students, is Book the Hall. Uh, and on the second floor is a young lady, is a, is a senior administrative assistant by the name of Laura Miller Francis. And Laura... You have to go to her to get... Laura Miller Francis position. has the form because you're an external group. Okay. You just can call her up. Laura Miller Francis is F R A N C I S. You can call her up and say, I need a form. She might be able to email it to you, or you can just drop by her office, get the form, fill it out, turn it in right there. She starts the process because she's going to ask you, Do you need tables and chairs? Do you need electric? Do you need that stuff? And then certain people around campus go, Check, check, good. And then they give it back to you. Okay? That's I mean, all? I understand that, that you have this process to go through for registered you know student organization for but everyone we are. Pe people who hand out our bibles they'll be here on tuesday that organization which is a longtime partner of the institution is an external men's group they come in every year and fill out the form and they stand at every yeah. entrance across campus and hand out bibles anthony are we a group on campus though we are i mean we've been in about a year a student organization yes well, then you start at the source downstairs the student organization resource center we're not registered but we've been on campus and what does that mean? So you are a student organization? We were, we were a right, but we lost our status as an official org group, correct? So, I don't think so. No, we never had official status. Uh -huh. Okay, so you're still considered a, a group of people who are allowed to assemble on the University of Akron's campus. You just need to go through the normal process like everybody else. And will be approved today? No, you won't. Do you, uh, no, I'm sorry, sir. You will not be approved today. It's a three day, three day, up to three days. Th that is the condition of us being out here yes it is sir to even just solicit is. contacts you can't i'm sorry you're soliciting i can show you the rule the board of trustees rule that says what there's is no the, is solicitation there, on is campus. there a specific policy number yeah there is have? and i don't have that on me but if you go to the board of trustees website and put in for board rule and if you put in solicitation you'll find the board rule so what will be the consequence of happening if we stay i'm going to call the police and you're going to be charged with trespassing so you're ordering us that could happen i'm not going to do that okay. i'm just giving I don't you want that to your happen, advice right. I, I need to go in there and do what my due, due diligence is today but i'm giving you as much time as i can at the moment which says i've told you how to do the process i've told you you shouldn't be here i've also told you as a university official if you don't go with my desired wishes which is what i i do here is is it's against university policy Okay. okay. We will um, what about leave. We will go to Butcher Hall and through the process, but we will leave right now okay. under protest and duress. Um, okay. Okay. Right okay. That, that's okay. You're more than welcome. Tomorrow and the next days, I'll have far more people than right now. Okay. I guarantee you. You will. <laughs> 29,000 students will be here tomorrow going to class. So if you go fill your form out at 8 o'clock, it will be approved by Tuesday when the, the other 29,000 show up for Tuesday classes. Time. You will be just fine. You'll just, just, a... just to be sure, Ann, like so, like if we're out here just trying to practice our First Amendment rights and get people to come to our group, yeah, we're in violate. Even though we're trying to do our First Amendment rights, we're not allowed doing this. Because within the First Amendment rights, 
also is to follow university policy. So uh -huh. I guarantee you that if you decide to take up audience in a Wendy's, they're not going to let you. You're trespassing. Private property. Okay, it's trespassing. Uh -huh. So in this instance, we have trespass laws that work for us too. Okay, mm -hmm. the, the University of Akron does. It's their, pro it's it's this property. Even for okay. students who go to the school and yeah. it's a public university. Yes, it is. And so to organize mm -hmm. and to do an organized duty, that's what it takes. Okay. Okay. So as a whole, that's what this is. So okay. for like students who go here yes. at a public university paid for by the taxpayers, we're not allowed to be here. In an organized fashion. Okay, so we're not allowed to organize. What if we were to split off as students who go here? I'm I'm not hearing you. Okay. 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 All right. Thank I, you, ma'am. I, I need to go do what I do, and and, and if, if if police stop you and say what they need to say to you, you you've been doing your work. Okay. Thank okay. you, ma'am. Well, All right. Nice afternoon. All right.